once you've opened the template and before you've made a copy of it, which you can see you can do with that button right there, you should take a look around and, and just familiarize yourself a little bit with it in the play mode. And um, you click on full screen as I just did to see and see it full screen. And then you can use the arrow buttons on your computer keyboard or down here to scroll through the path that I've put in where there's various things kind of highlighted, some helpful hints for using the template, uh, an abstract uh, space for your abstract for your VFE, some important details if you want to use that, some notes if you want to use that. Uh, here are some pictures from the Devil's Lake area of Wisconsin where we did a workshop in 2011 and the idea here is that you replace those pictures and the label and text with pictures of your own. Uh, here's some more pictures from Devil's Lake and again noting that you can replace those images with your own. And then some resources if you uh, zoom in on these, you'll see that we've got a handout for uh, geoscience questions. If you click here, this will uh, download the file in another window, which you won't be able to see because you're in full screen mode. Um, and you can see what those questions are. And one of the nice things about Prezi is you can zoom in and take a closer look. And I did that just uh, by dragging across my uh, touchpad on my laptop here. Um, and also here is information on a link to virtualfieldwork.org and Earth Science Bigger Ideas and, and various kinds of resources. And then that was going off the path. Here is uh, icons where you can also, again, click on that. That'll open it up in another window where you'll be able to access the full suite of icons that we've put together for using in either Google Earth or Prezi. Um, and here is the heart and soul of the template, and that is a graphic organizer for um, looking at uh, a particular field site with a series of generically framed questions and space for your pictures to go in. And you'll see that as I scroll around, a box might highlight like that, which allows me to zoom in on a uh, particular element within uh, the uh, graphic organizer. Um, and you can see also that there's a graphic organizer within the graphic organizer for uh, environmental science questions more than uh, geology questions, which is what the larger um, graphic organizer is. And that's just kind of a quick look through of the VFE gra graphic organizer. I hit escape to get myself out of full screen mode. And the next thing that we'll do is make a copy of it, and that'll also lead us into setting up a Prezi account. So I click Make a Copy, and I come to this, and I want to sign up now. And here you'll see there's a student and teachers link, and if you're one of those things, you want to go with the student and teacher package because you'll get more, uh, more bang for your buck or more bang for free, as the case may be. So... Uh, here is the educator package, which is free if you have the appropriate uh, um, email address that can um, indicate that you're associated with an educational institution. And I've, I'm going to plug in my information here. It does have to be an email address for the educator package that's clearly associated with your uh, educational institution. And there we go. And let's go to museum of the earth.org and click there to continue and an educational, uh, or I'm sorry, a confirmation has been sent to me. So with that, I'm going to uh, end this recording and get ready for the next one.